Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can fix your Xbox One that won't start a game or sometimes your game crashes and things like that. So if your game won't start guys, also this works on all the games, it doesn't matter which one. You can also join the Aerofix community if you need more help and let's start off. So the first thing you want to do is, for example, if you are trying to start off Call of Duty, Modern Warfare or Minecraft, what you want to do first is you want to press on start. On here you want to click on quit and then you want to go ahead and try it again so this is the first fix what you can try out <coughs> but if this doesn't work out I'm gonna show you another, another one actually so now let's go to the home button and what you want to do guys is you want to go to settings on settings go to devices and streaming on devices and streaming just click on blu-ray now just click on persistent storage guys and then you want to clear your persistent storage and this will just delete your corrupted data and things like that that prevent you from using your disk and things like that so just by doing this you can p actually fix your problem so you try out guys and let's go to the next fix if you don't have this option or if you don't have blu-ray now for the people that don't have a disk drive or a blu-ray so what you need to do is you want to go ahead and close off your console by holding the power button so keep holding the power button till you see no more lights coming out of your xbox and once you don't see anything guys go to the back of your xbox and plug everything out so plug every cable that you have on your xbox plugged in just out especially the power cord itself and go to the big power brick and also turn that off from there and you want to wait about like three minutes average wait about like three to four minutes and that's it and you want to plug everything back on and once you plug it back everything on it will also clear your cache and this is more for the people that don't have a disk drive but people that do have a disk drive they can also try this out and see for themselves if it works out or not now let's go to the next step what we also can do so what we also can do is we can call, keep holding the power button and we can just go ahead and restart the console we can always do this guys and it will also maybe fix your problem so let's go to the next fix the next fix you want to go to settings <coughs> on here guys you want to go to system and go to storage on here you want to look at your use storage it could happen that your use storage is too much up for example if you have about 90 percent used it means that you can have this problem and what you want to do is you want to go to make more space and on make more space for example like you see on leftover add-ons you want to clear some space and on leftover add-ons so what it is is actually it's like deleted games for example <coughs> if you already deleted my minecraft or fortnite and it already has like a couple saved data or dlc packs or something as like an update on of that game that you already deleted you can just go ahead and delete those leftover add-ons it's really that simple and on shrinkable games it sometimes lets you shrink some games for example let's just say call of duty if it's like taking 100 gigs it will go down to 50 gig uh, 50 gigs for example so these are some fixes what you also can do and if these don't fix your problem what you also can do is you can go to the home button and on the home button click to my games and apps and go to see all so if none of these options work as the last option actually you can go ahead and try to uh, delete your games but before you delete your games i just want to say guys check your disk out before deleting it it could happen that your disk is the problem itself or your disk drive you can go ahead and check if it's scratched or things like that or if it's getting like properly into your disk drive and after checking that out and if it's like nothing wrong with that you can just try out click on manage on the game that's corrupted or doesn't start
so go to uninstall so uninstall a game and re-download it so this is the last option what you can do guys or what you also can try out is you can try to delete your save data but like i said guys it will delete your save data and the things what you did will be lost and these are the fixes guys and i just want to say if you still need more help you can just go ahead and join our fix community for more help and you can also just comment down below if you need more help and thanks for watching guys, please like, subscribe and comment down below and take care of yourself guys, goodbye.